welcome back. Well, it's the time uh, for hot summer love, and you know, maybe things just aren't going your way. All right, so we have uh, Lisa Goodwin Snell here right now to kind of get us started, the, the jump start. All the essentials. Okay, okay the essentials. How to, be, how to be successful for the summer. Okay, and adult dating is a lot different than when you're a teenager because, yeah. you know, hopefully you're more comfortable with yourself by that right. point, but you also have some issues. Yeah, well, you know? if you're not in college anymore, where do you meet singles, you mm -hmm. know? So, especially if you're divorced, you know, where do you go? What do you do? What's the essentials? So we've got a summer... Well, first place course is the bar, right? <laughs> well, that's well, there are a lot of people who don't want to meet someone at a yeah. bar. Yeah. And, and how much can you trust that that's a good place to meet someone who has your same values? Yeah, come on. Because you don't know if they're alcoholic or not. You I know what I mean? I just brought that up because uh, th that's what a lot of people say or maybe do. Yes. <laughs> There's Not that I would go to the bar. <laughs> well, let's ask the yeah. Utah's dating coach for the real, real yeah. scoop. Well, here's the thing. We've got a summer boot camp coming up on Saturday. Oh, boot it's camp. an all-day okay. workshop, so it's a great way to get jump-started for your summer. And the first thing we're going to teach at the boot camp is to set some goals. People don't plan on failing. They fail to plan. So you need to know what it is you want to accomplish by the end of the yeah, summer. Yeah, good. How many dates do you want to go on? What kind of men or women do you want to meet? What kind of experience do you want to have? And so at the summer boot camp, we're going to be talking about that. But the same thing applies as we're talking today. If you want to accomplish something by the end of the summer, you need to know what it is. Because mm -hmm. people don't plan on failing. They fail to plan. Um, the next thing is you need to know where singles are and how to attract singles, even in your everyday life. The third one is you need to know how to flirt and pursue and show confidence. Women are looking for strength and confidence mm -hmm. in men. Men are work, work, looking for femininity and confidence. And how do you pull that off? A lot of women do not know how to flirt. They do not know if they are flirting. So we'll be covering that in the boot camp too. So what's the problem? Well, you know, if they're not flirting, they're not going to get attention. A woman who has not been on a date in the last six months, it is simply because she is not flirting, and she uh -huh. probably doesn't know how. Okay, give us an example of flirting. Flirting would be, okay, well, let's simply. stand up. Okay. It's, it's <laughs> well, role play. Because, because this is what we do, Ron. Yeah, okay. it's role Remember, play. you need to stand like... He has to stand a certain way. Well, and that's still strength and confidence. Yeah, because remember? as a man, you're look, we're looking for strength and confidence. When you're, you know, leaning mm -hmm. forward, it shows a little bit more intensity. As a big guy, you'd want to kind of stand more to, at a little bit of a cool. So you're not so intimidating. So, so you don't want your. So you're not intimidating. Your space violated. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. And any woman who's leaning forward to you is interested. This is the oh. wording. That, that's <laughs> oh, I love that. That's oh, yeah, that exactly. is great. Eye contact. Touch, yeah. Eye contact. But I'd be good. Those kind of things. Simply, I dated a lot. <laughs> <laughs> simply brushing, simply brushing your hair away. Anything, that's anything that is slow and Should purposeful. I if I do anything that's slow and purposeful, that can look like flirting. And it's you know giving a sincere compliment. The purpose of flirting and pursuing is to make them feel great. Right. So if that's my goal and I'm making them feel great, I'm not going to go far wrong. Okay. Now you guys flirt. You're Botox. I can't even tell. <laughs> I, mean, I would never know. <laughs> We both have the crease right here. Yeah, okay. well, we need another round. Okay, okay. can I all sit down? <laughs> she is a trained professional. All right. So. Okay, so guys, they have to know how to flirt, too. Yeah. Well, they do, do they? but really what comes across as strong and confident is when they're pursuing. A man can flirt and flirt and flirt, but if he never pursues, he does not look as strong and confident. Close the deal. So knowing how to go in right. for asking for her number and handling rejection well, and your chin is really essential for that. If you get rejected and you drop your chin, it looks like shame. If you get rejected, you keep your chin forward and you say, you're a beautiful woman, I hope you have a great day. And you walk away with your shoulders square. As you walk away, and then you she own, might go out then, with you. Then she'll well, think twice she, about really? it. Really? That's exactly yeah. the point. And once you can face rejection, and you're not so afraid of it anymore. Okay. So if uh, they'd like to get to, in touch with me, I have what I call the 17 secrets to the male and female psychology. I will email that to them. Mm. That'll help prep them. Any, any of your listeners, watchers, viewers, um, they can contact me at Alisa, A-L-I-S-A, -S just like Lisa, but with an A, mm -hmm. at askalisa.org. So Alisa at askalisa.org. Okay. Also on your list, in 10 seconds, where do you go? To find you know you can find them at your nephew's soccer game if you know how to flirt and pursue with confidence and so yes you can go to the internet I definitely recommend the internet but it also can be a dangerous place so mm -hmm. the summer boot camp can go through a lot of ways to do that safely but there's lots of ways to to prime up your summer and you can meet your goals I've got someone who's doing nine dates by nine nine of oh nine she's already been on two and she had not been on dates for four years oh that's really oh. cool mm -hmm. that's yeah great. I know as I started getting a little bit older and I was still single I started just being a little more honest. Like, you know, if, if it just there was no chemistry, if they asked you out again, it's like, you know what, I think you should. You this be isn't going to work. Else. Okay. Yeah. You know, because okay. no one, especially in your 30s and 40s and 50s, no one wants to waste time. No. 
And it shows strength and confidence when you can say that in a very warm, respectful way, make him feel good at yeah. the end of it, and when he can keep his chin forward and show that you do yeah, not define that. his value. Chin. All right. Well, this okay. has been a fun segment. Yeah. Our producer's going, cat, 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 cat. We can continue talking about this for a long time. <laughs> it's so much yeah. fun. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's talk about weather now. Well, we can talk about weather all day, too.